exercise 9.2 question number 2 if e f g and h are the respectively the midpoints of the sides of a parallelogram a b c d show that area of e f g h is equal to half of area of a b c d suppose this is our required figure with parallelogram a b c d which has midpoint e f g and h respectively now let us join h f first with a straight line like this suppose this is a straight line which joins h and f now in parallelogram ab cd we can see that ad is equal to bc and ad is parallel to bc since it is a parallelogram a b c d is a parallelogram opposite sides of a parallelogram are equal and parallel opposite sides of parallelogram are equal and parallel and also ab is equal to cd since opposite sides of a parallelogram are equal opposite sides of parallelogram are equal which implies half ad is equal to 1 by 2 bc which implies ah is equal to bf and also ah is parallel to bf since h and f points of ad and bc therefore ab fh is a parallelogram now from the figure we can observe that triangle H E F and parallelogram A B F H are on the same base that is H F and between the same parallel lines A B and H F triangle H E F and parallelogram ab fh are on same base hf and 
between the same parallel lines AB and HF therefore area of triangle HEF is equal to half of area of ABFH let us say this is our equation 1 similarly we can prove that area of triangle H G F is equal to half of area of H D C F let's say this is our equation 2 now adding equation 1 and 2 we will get area of triangle HEF plus area of triangle HGF is equal to half of area of AB F H plus half of area of H D C F. Now from here we can say that area of triangle H E F plus triangle HGF will give area of EFGH which is equal to half of area of ABFH plus half of area of HDCF will give half of area of AB CD hence area of EF GH is equal to area of half of area of AB CD hence proved